Let's, let's try again. Right. right let's try again. <laughs> Derby bar. I wonder if I should go down here. Where's this path go? Let's see what's down this path. Where's this path go? Oh, it just goes to just goes to nowhere. That's this path. That's what it was. Does that go to? Oh, it doesn't go to anything. This goes to a hut. There we are. Oh, Darby, you're coming back in. I need that you keep your eye on this reception. Nonsense. You're coming back in. I've just start putting my gloves on. I just wonder where that path goes. It doesn't go anywhere. Oh yeah, it's the black swans. I should have waited till I've got my bird food out. Ah, oh, here she is. Ah, oh, stupid connection. Let's go say hello to the black swans. Ah, oh, she's back. Hang on. Whoop. Earth calling Colorado. Right, here yeah, is the black swans. Come say hello anyway. Come on, don't attack me. There you are. <laughs> Hello. Hello, black swans. Hang on, don't attack me. I'm, I'll give you some food in a minute. Don't attack me. Hang on. Let me just, uh, just bear with me. The ducks come say hello, the swan. Hang on. In a minute, in a minute. Let me get the food <laughs> You aren't keeping your social distance. Keep away. Six feet. Too close. Come on, social distance. Too close. Yeah. Yeah. It's on the floor there. <laughs> I've just thrown the food on the floor. Yeah. All well, the bit. Oh, all the coots are coming now. Hang on. Hang on. I'm all. I'm all fingers and thumbs. Let me just throw it in this. Let me just throw it in the pond for him. Yeah. <laughs> Hey, I'll get all them. That's better. I'll just throw the food in the water. That's better. What do you want? I'm just giving you some food. Hello. Don't bite me. Yeah. Yeah, that's over here. Hey, I think the coots are hungry. Crikey. Hang on. Hang on a minute. Oh, that's it. Yeah, he's confused. Yeah, let's give him some food. That's it. They can't see it when you just throw it on the path. I wanted to try throw it in the water. Uh, they know where it is now. Throw it in the water. There we go. Gets confused when you just throw it on the ground. They don't know where it is. I think nobody's been feeding them today. <laughs> right, let's just stay here a second as long as we've got a good connection. Yeah, I don't know what happens when you walk around. I don't know what happens when you walk around this lake. It's just so weird how you can just get little black spots of no reception. I don't know what's going on. It's so, so weird mobile signal. It's a bit like the virus, isn't it? You've just got like a sort of signal in the air that lets you do periscope and you don't know where it is. And you hope it's everywhere that you're walking. <laughs> I, wonder, I wonder, I have to look up the science of it or why you sort of, it works sort of three quarters of the way around. And then you just have like no signal for a few seconds. But well, what you get on my end, if you've noticed on your derby, you get like that little red bar comes up, don't it, when it's like lost connection. If I see that, I'll have to be on my guard if I see that red bar coming across. I think it might lose its connection for a second. Yeah, it's just like the COVID, isn't it? Internet signals, just like COVID. But I just had a good idea with that chap you were on about, you know, where he pre-recorded his videos and then talked about them. I'll have to, I'll have to, because I'm just thinking I could have, I could walk all around here and film it on my phone in HD. We could all sit at home with our feet up and have a nice cup of tea, and I can give you a little, give you a little narration of where I've been. So trying to do, trying to do it live, yeah. 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 Trying to get pneumonia and flu and everything, yeah. <laughs> I know, but uh, 
I've had all those coffees bought for me anyway. I'll have to get a coffee on the way out. That uh, generous chap who bought me five coffees a few days ago. <laughs> oh, haps, yeah. 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 Oh, yeah, it's some more black swans, you know. You can't feed them unless they're in the water. It's a bit awkward when they aren't in the water, really. <laughs> it's some more black swans. Let's go have a look. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. Obviously, when you, when, you, when you struggle with reception, though, and obviously, at the moment, yeah, I see some more black swans. Yeah, they make a nice sound, don't they? These are a lot calmer. These are calmer than these. You never know where they're going. They're always, they're always about the same area, the lake, you know, the black ones. Yeah, they're always in the same spot every time you come round. Uh, yeah, it looks like white. Yeah, it looks like they've got elastic band around the, around the beaks, yeah. Like a white piece of yeah. 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 Let's just give them a bit more food. I'd rather feed them in the water because this food's meant to this food's meant to be on, like floating on the water, but uh, they're all out to the water here, so you're not near the water bank. So let's just throw them some food down. Yeah. As long as we've got the black swans, that's the. That's the that's the main reason to come round the lake anyway, just for the black swans. I wasn't going to come round, but you have to come round for find the black swans. There we go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, obviously, I like the liveness of obviously, like now I can just wander off wherever I want. You know, you go, oh, look at that over there, you know, and it's just a bit random. But it's usually okay for signal, obviously there's no rhyme or reason to it. I mean I've been I've been on four different networks, you know, I've done the same walks on all the networks and you just can't and obviously you'll get comments on the you know the quality. You know, and obviously if I, if I come round here every day I think it'd be different. Because I've been round here sometimes and I've scoped all the way round and it's been fine, so I just obviously I can't answer the questions why the signal isn't perfect all the time, you know, so perhaps it could be Perhaps it could just be like the weather could affect it, you know, or how many people are using the app. I don't know. So many variables, I think. <sighs> anyway, we've got. Yeah, I mean, basically, yeah, I'd probably do, I'd do a periscope of you and I watching my pre recorded videos, like, so we could still interact and you can ask me what I'm looking at or any questions, you know. But, uh, I don't know how much rain we're going to get. Obviously, if we get a lot of these bad days like this, it's really, it's really sort of gets frustrating trying to periscope in the rain, you know, like it's been today. Yeah, it's the problem is it's not cold enough. You see, that today it should be. I was hoping with periscoping this year to have a lot of like crispy days, you know, where it's like minus three and it's blue sky and the sun's out, you know, but it's cold. But obviously, when you have these windy, wet days, it's sort of a uh, really de deflates you from doing any periscopes. Let's hope you can hear this. Can you hear the sound of water? Yeah. This is the, the overflow for the lake. This is the overflow for the lake at the back. This is what it's, it's, it's running crazy now. This is one good thing about when it rains because obviously you've got a lot of overflow. So we aren't out of the woods yet. If I lose connection, I'll just restart again. And then when I'm back in the Italian garden end, uh, if you keep your fingers crossed, if we're in here till just by four o'clock, we might turn all the lights on. And we might enjoy all the uh, all the lights being turned on. Right, yeah, I just have to... Uh, 
but it's hard to hear over the sound of the water, hang on. It's quite noisy, the water, yeah, you can see how much it's coming over here now. It's obviously emptying out into the River Trent, this is the River Trent. And there's the main road to Stafford, over there, you can see in the distance. I say this is the nicest side of the lake when I'm probably the connection's a bit dodgy. <laughs> Let's just try and stand still. As long as it's clear, I'll just stand still for a second. Yeah, I'll just stand still for a few seconds. I keep moving too much. I'll just stand there for a second. Yeah, I mean, I don't know if it, if it affects, obviously, how you have a case on your phone, you know, because, I mean, it's technically blocking the signal a bit, isn't it? But obviously you can't. You can't have an iPhone without a case on it, it'll smash it. <laughs> You've got to have a case on an iPhone. Yeah, well I think uh, I did ask Santa for a gimbal. I think I want a gimbal, I think. Please Santa, buy me a gimbal. Yeah, I want one of those big fancy ones, you know, that auto rotates and you can do the zoom on a little joystick on it, like you can do all the zoom on your phone and everything. Yeah, because I know you, uh, I know that, I don't know if it's an issue with Android, but I mean, I've seen people who've got Apple phones and they seem to use it fine, you know, the, I think it's like a little, yeah, well, I was thinking of the, yeah, I was thinking of that DJI one that seems, I've got, got some good reviews on the DJI one. Uh, Yeah, this is a rowing club, I think. These are all the boats, look. These are the boats all tied up. I think this is a rowing club. There we go. Right. Right, we're halfway round. There's, the, uh, there's the view at the back. There we go. Obviously, I don't know if the, the, the quality of poly varies. We're walking round. This is the back of the lake now. There's the monkey forest. There's the gate to the monkey forest. I have scoped the monkey forest a few months ago. But it's closed now for uh, the season. And then we'll have to return and see all the monkeys. See all the monkeys, monkey, monkey. Oh, we are, he's a snowman. There we go. Snowman. Yeah, so we just I just popped in a few a few food stores yesterday uh, with me mom. We don't get a lot of any, we just buy stuff for ourselves, just us two really. Just got a bit a few of the bits and bobs, you know, some turkey. Uh, we don't usually buy like a big, you know, like a massive turkey. We just buy one of those. Uh, I don't know what if you buy them in America. I don't know what you call it. Uh, it's a bit like a joint, you know. It's not a full size turkey. It's probably just a enough for two people, you know, like a. I don't know if you buy them in America. Yeah, it's like a little, it's like a little tin foil thing. It's just like a joint of turkey you can just put in the oven. Like a, it isn't a full bird. It's like a joint, like a joint of meat. You know, it's like a joint of meat. But yeah, they like um, they come. They look about enough for two people. They like quite, and then they have like all bacon wrapped around the top of it, and then you just put it in the oven for two hours. Yeah, because that's where we've got a lot of our traditions, like turkey, I think, comes from America, that we all have turkey. Because traditionally, on a, if you talk about, like, uh, if you talk about, like, the, uh, what do you call it, you know, like Charles Dickens' Christmas Carol and all that, you know, the Victorian Christmas. Obviously, there was no, there was no, if you look at all those old novels, there's no mention of turkey. Because obviously, it seemed to be all, like, um, yeah, it was all like ge geese and like fowl, wasn't it? It was like pheasant and fowl and guinea fowl. And... Like there'd be some sort of bird, but it wouldn't be. I think turkey and cranberries are like an American import, I think, all this cranberry and turkey. But, uh... right, let me just get my breath back. 
Well, it's quite, uh, quite what you call bracing today. The weather's quite bracing today. I've already had a, I've already had a walk in the rain for an hour, and <laughs> it's finally gone off. Which I told you that always happens when you, when you have a walk in the rain. I, I was nearly singing my songs with my walking group today. Oh, they would give me some funny looks. I think I felt like singing, singing the songs what we normally do. Yeah, Nigella, Nigella, Nigella's there, yeah. Nigella Lawson, she's like a female cook on British television. She's like one of those TV chefs. <laughs> Nigella. Oh, God. Hang on, can I just stop you there? Let me just stop you there. Uh, just before we... <laughs> I just want to warn you, I've ate, no, I've, ate, I've ate nothing for about three hours, so I'm trying to steer away from food. <laughs> next, su next subject. I'm not reading comments about food. <laughs> yeah, well, I say what I mean, obviously we can talk about it. I'll try and talk without feeling hungry, but... I like all the trimmings. Like on my, on, my, on my plate, I'd have like turkey, cranberry. I'd have so, you know bacon wrapped around sausages. Uh, you know stuffing, cranberry, roast potatoes, or mash, or carrots, sprouts, turnips, parsnips, anything. I'll just have like a massive, massive big plate with a bit of everything on. Because I'm not a fussy eater. I like everything, so I'd probably just put a bit of everything on. Yeah, pigs in blanket. That's it. Yeah. Now, what I was going to try and obviously, uh, Melanie will understand, it. obviously you'll be able to tell me with obviously living where you are, it's basically in the UK, we call like Christmas Day and Boxing Day and New Year's Day like a public holiday in the UK, but you just treat every day normal days, don't you, in America, or is it, is it state by state different? Yeah, because I, 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 it flummoxed me when I used to follow somebody on YouTube and they were saying they're going to Disneyland on Christmas Day and I thought, it's open on Christmas Day, you know, I thought, because obviously in the UK we always think it's the only day off that like, sort of workers have for a day off, you know, always, it's always everywhere's closed Christmas Day, you know, and obviously that's like a, a UK law really, you know, everywhere's closed. And I think with a lot of retail workers that's the only time they have off on Christmas Day. Because that Sainsbury's where I've shown you, I basically looked at the opening times last night and basically the only time they closed is Christmas Day. That's obviously UK rules, you know. Basically everywhere. Yeah. Yeah, I suppose that's not retail. Yeah, the, the retail laws will be different than theme parks, I suppose. But I mean, basically with the UK, if you think, if you think what can I do on Christmas Day? I say it's usually just either visiting family or watching the TV, you know, there's not, there's not really any way, anywhere open you can go to, you know, apart from perhaps like, uh, yeah, I was just going to say, yeah, I, I knew that, yeah, that's what I was just going to say, but I, I was, I think I was open, I was not open Christmas Day, I don't think, but I know yours open Christmas Day, your movie theatres. But that's something we have to wait till we have to wait till uh, Boxing Day. Yeah, we always have one. Uh, obviously in the UK, that's the difference. Is obviously with America, I've noticed that. I say like Disneyland will be open, and obviously your your movies are always preview your, your premiere on Christmas Day, don't we? So that's just where we have our little differences. Right. I think the sky's brightening up a little bit. A little bit. Uh, no sun, but. Uh, and now it's got us all soaked. Yeah, it's coming out a little bit, a bit brighter over there. But, uh, yeah. Oh. I know you need to do more cooking scopes. I like watching people cooking. <laughs> I used to love cooking programs when I was young, you know, watching all the chefs making things. I used to enjoy watching them. But... Yeah, because I seem to enjoy watching people cooking, but not really doing it. Doing it myself, I enjoy watching all the cooking programs. 
that's uh but obviously there's a difference in the uk obviously you, if you i've told you look up the hairy bikers they're more like a down-to-earth chef somehow you know where you know i don't like watching the programs where they're very pretentious like a lot of gordon ramsay what he does you know but more the i like more the down-to-earth chefs you know where they they do like traditional british food you know like cottage pie and you know the basic sort of uh, the basic stuff that you want in a cold winter you know like broths and soups and things like that you know things that you want in a, living in a cold country plenty of hot things and uh, plenty of hot food oh. the uh, uh what was i saying now uh, yeah, what time, what time of the day it is? I can hear kitchen utensils. Are you doing breakfast? <laughs> I can sense I can sense you're doing breakfast. Yeah, I can hear the, I can hear the clatter of kitchen utensils. Oh, Christmas. All right, what time are we on? Uh, on? Yeah, it's quarter past three here in the afternoon. Quarter past three. So how many? How many? You were, yeah, well, the ride's already here. Or basically, that was what was interrupting me. Uh, that's what was up, interrupting me periscope a bit earlier. Um, she was just ringing me and see where I was. So I said I'm in Trenton Gardens, and she's gone off. She's gone off doing some. She's on the. She's on the premises, but she's. Uh, she's gone off to what she wants, and I'm doing me walk. So, let's just go. Yeah, I just said. Uh, obviously, I said the. Uh, I said, obviously, they kicked me out of the park in 45 minutes. Uh, obviously, this bit where I am. And uh, they kicked me out of the park in 45 minutes. But if you keep your fingers crossed, there is like a, a night, there's a vet event where people can come in at the night time and they switch all these nighttime lights on. And uh, we might be lucky and we might catch someone. I'll try and be, I'll try to stay in there for five minutes and see if they turn the lights on. They wait for everybody to go and then turn the lights on, you see. They turn them on at about five past four. Then we might have a bit of a show. We might, we might have a nice show or not, I don't know. We'll see how we go. We can't arrest you for being, just say you were lost and you're five minutes late getting to the exit anyway. So. What they'll probably do is you've seen before is they have like a, they have like a golf buggy, like a golf cart, and it'll come round probably near four o'clock and say, can you make your way to the exit, please? You know, and that's what you'll get. So they aren't going to sort of manhandle you to the exit. You know, they'll just suggest you go to the exit. And then they probably manhandle you if you're here too long. <laughs> they probably take you to the exit. They probably take you to the exit in the in the golf buggy. Let's just try and uh... right, we've got the dreaded low power mode. Hang on, twenty percent battery. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Where's my battery? Hang on. Oh, I need four pairs of hands doing this scoping. Hang on. Just got me a battery plugged in. Hang on. Oh. Right. Yeah, I'll have to start growing four pairs of arms for all this periscoping. Hang on. Right. All oh, right. Yeah, in a second. Hang on. Oh, I'm just trying to take my mind off a cold at the minute. Just trying to think of a. A nice ruby at the end of this walk. Oh, I need a warm drink. <laughs> Alright, hang on. Hang on. Swans have come say hello. Yeah. Hello. You were going too close, don't hiss at me. <laughs> Hang on, let's have a look. Let's have a look, hang on. Third, third variant. Da, 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 da. Let's try, let's try, let's try. Let's have a look. Yeah, African people. Yeah, I mean, she's. The problem is, I mean, I. I used to watch the news and then I. Uh, I used to. Uh, I just don't put it on anymore because it's obviously. Uh, I mean, it's a struggle for me to get through this time of year anyway without all, all this bug, so. 
I'm trying to keep my spirits up, I say, with all this periscope and all this walking and exercise. And uh, it's always a difficult time for me anyway, so without getting into too much detail. But uh, uh, yeah, I mean, it's something I don't look forward to. Obviously, I'm just trying to, trying to muddle through it every day. But uh, uh, yeah, you're just muddling through. And obviously, but obviously, you used to have a lot of good TV shows you used to look forward to, you know, a lot of, a lot of Christmas specials and things, you know. But obviously, the TV hasn't been produced the way it has been, obviously, with all this going on. So there are some TV shows. I've noticed, uh, I don't know if you noticed this on your TV programmes, but... Obviously, uh, a few of our programmes, we are noticing them coming back, but obviously they've got no audiences, you know. Like that, 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 come down, that Strictly Come Dancing's come back, and I've seen a few new shows coming on where they have no audience. So they are producing shows. But obviously all the, uh, like that, who, who Wants to Be a Millionaire, I think that was on last week with no audience, you know. They are producing shows, but obviously they've been done with no audience. So they are trying to produce I mean, We even have chat shows on, we do. I don't know if you're aware of Graham Norton. I think he's on BBC America. We have a chat show host called Gra yeah, Graham Norton. His show returned and obviously had all the, the celebrities sitting about 12 feet apart. You know, it felt so weird watching it, you know. <laughs> They're all like 12 feet apart. Yeah. Yeah, I've got Sky anyway, but uh, I like watching a lot of Sky art, I like, I like a lot of documentaries. That's my favourite channel, we've just been discussing it on my walking group. And it basically used to be a premium channel that you had to pay for, and now it's gone on our free-to-air channels, you know, that are free to everybody. And it's called, uh, it's like an arts channel, and they basically have like, uh, they basically have like documentaries about musicians, or actors or directors, you know, music groups. Uh, there's a good Queen doc. Sky Arts, A R T S, yes, yeah, Sky Arts. Yeah, it's a. Uh, they, have, they have all like the culture and uh, they have live concerts of some pop groups, you know, they have live concerts. But uh, they've even had some. Uh, I think there was a Queen documentary on last night. It was on about two hours. It's like a Queen documentary telling you the history of Queen. That was good. And, uh, yeah, I love documentaries, anything about true, true people, you know. Because, uh, obviously, the chat, the chat shows aren't the same as they used to be. Um, obviously, we used to have... We used to have, like... Oh, Obviously, if you go on the modern shows, they're always just coming on to promote a film or a book, you know, or a song. Where years ago, I like watching all the old repeats of where they used to like, you know, the proper movie stars, you know, and they used to interview all the, all the proper movie stars years ago, you know. Yeah, Queen's a top group. But, uh, yeah, I think... Uh, I've got some Queen stamps because the, the UK Postal Service always produce special stamps and I've got some Queen stamps. I think they bought some James Bond ones out as well. They're always bringing, uh, they're always bringing special, special stamps out. But, uh, I'll say this is, the, this is what you get with people walking towards this. It's supposed to be a one-way system, you see, but nobody cares. <laughs> they just go whichever way they want. Obviously, I can understand they do perhaps when they've got to, when they've got like busy, busy, like busy times, you know, like the, like at the weekend and everything, you know, like busy times at the weekend. But uh, yeah, I mean, this one-way system can get a bit crazy. If it's not busy, obviously you shouldn't really have to implement it if it isn't busy. But, uh, right, send me. Are we having something nice about? Yeah, we'll have to try that experiment of doing something like just record it on your phone. And then obviously, I don't know if you have Chromecast on your TV or anything, you know, where you can make your YouTube videos come on your big screen, you know. It looks start being a bit like David Attenborough and doing like a commentary on everything. <laughs>
get a sort of David, David Attenborough vibe where he always does all the commentaries, don't he, for his, uh, his nature videos. Yeah, just, uh, yeah, I think the weather's going to me now a bit. It's, uh, it stopped raining, but I still feel cold from the rain. And obviously it's getting a bit blustery and windy now, so I'm just, uh, I just keep it. I just keep dreaming about that nice hot ruby at the end of my walk a bit later on. And me, yes, because that's why it's so important to follow me on buy me a coffee, isn't it, Darby? It's very important to uh, keep the scopers hydrated with hot liquids. And uh, yes, it's a uh, it's a lovely a lovely place. You can follow me on buymeacoffee.com forward slash Jason Hoop. And if you like my content, you can. Uh, Buy me a coffee. Support the channel. Darby will concur on that. It's an excellent website. <laughs> right. I think I'll stop. I'll have to start another site, but I'll have to do a buymeagimbal.com. I'll start that. Buymeagimbal.com. Yeah. Buymeacar.com. Yeah. We'll, do a, we'll try buymeagimbal.com, then we'll try buymeacar.com, see if that one works. <laughs> buy me a, no, buy, no, what I'll do is I'll do buymeamini.com. Buy me I'll do that one and see if that works. I wonder if Google can tell you how much a plane ticket is. Does, see, will Google answer that? Say how much is a plane ticket to the UK? I wonder how much it is. Come on, see if she'll say, I don't understand. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, yeah, I was just thinking, yeah, there's no, there's no flying, is there? So that's a good deal. <laughs> I suppose it'd be really cheap when everything, I suppose when everything, when everything, well, that's what we've got to do, aren't it? When all, when all this is back to normal, everybody be, there'll be like bargains on everything, won't there? Flights and cars and everything. Because nobody's buying it. Yeah. But uh, I, know, I know when... Uh, no, I mean... The, uh, well, that's how Periscope works. I mean, I remember, I remember being on Periscope from the early days and... Uh, I remember being on Periscope the early days and they used to have meet meetups with all the scopers. I remember seeing a few meetups when Periscope first started. Yeah, I used to I used to follow people when it first started. There used to be two people who lived in London and then there used to be somebody who lived in Birmingham and somebody else. And that four four of them used to meet up in London and might do like a four way scope in London. But what I was uh, Yeah, yeah. This is what we're missing. You see, these are all the lights. If it was dark now, look, they've got lights over all these type of things. See, so the uh, all these lights, all these lights will get turned on in half an hour. I'm a bit too quick around the water. I was trying to pace myself so I don't get near the exit before four o'clock. Uh, I'm just on. Uh, I've got half an hour now, so uh, we'll just see how we go. They might turn the lights on. They might, uh, I left the park about five past four last week. They turned the lights on, so I think they wait till everybody leaves and then turn turn all the lights on. But, uh, you start seeing a few golf buggies driving around. There's one coming to. There's one. That, I think they just drive around and try and weigh up how many people are about. You know. Oh. Oh. Yeah, but I wish it was a bit more festive, the weather. Obviously, this is just like typical British weather, this is just this cold and wet and windy and uh, nothing festive about it at all. It'd be nice to see a bit of snow, but I think it's just too mild. It's just going to be loads of rain. And, uh, I know what I'll, I'll have to... Uh, yeah. We'll have to get like a snow machine. Yes. Oh, I know what I've I know what I've missed. Oh, sugar. 
I've just I've just got to say doe like Homer Simpson again. I've just realised what I haven't done. I've just realised what I haven't done. Dope. Well, I've got other things on my mind. Hang on. Uh, now I've just seen something. Yeah, I always say oh, sugar instead of swearing. <laughs> I always, yeah, I've got used to saying sugar when I mean something a bit stronger. Yeah, well, I've just seen something. Yeah, I think I've got like scopetica. I think I'm thinking the stronger words and saying the milder ones. What they've actually done, I, I can... I can still come back because I think it's on for about another. Oh, I can see the I can see the lights on. I can see the lights on. We're getting through the lights. I think I can see them. I can see them. Hang on. No, listen. Yeah, you've got to understand. I'm such a. You've got to understand. I'm like such a freezing cold and soaked through to the bone. But I'm trying to. I'm trying to ignore it. What I'm saying is, I saw on the website to Trentham Gardens this morning. They've got something else that you can walk around, and find. What, and what they've done is he says, you know the 12 days of Christmas song? Oh yeah, look what they've already even put in here for me. Look at this here. Ta -da. Oh. Got a phone stand, look. So you can take your photo. Oh, I think it's so you can take a photo. Basically, can you see that? What they've done. No, it's what they've put up here. So I think it's so you can put your phone on, look. Put your phone in so you can take a nice photo. No, what it is, you know, the 12 days of Christmas song. They said, they said the 12 days of Christmas, they've hid each day of the, the 12 days of Christmas song, they've hid each day some, something you have to find. So, which day is this? Can you remind me? Can you remind me this one? What's this day? Yeah, I'll look. <laughs> What day is this we found? What day is this? What's, is it, is it, what, how many drummers drumming, everybody? Come on. Pick your brains. What's the drummers drumming? What day is that? Sing the what you should have said to is sing the 12 Days of Christmas song. Just ask her, ask her, ask her, ask her, what's the 12 days of Christmas? And then it'll probably tell you. Uh, uh, uh. Oh, shut up. Yeah. Hang on, hang on. So, let me get me, uh, let me get me, uh, let me get me uh, gloves off. Hang on. Yeah, we're in a lot. We're in a lot. They turned all the lights on. They turned all the lights on. Look, yay! You won't, you won't tell on my camera, but they turned all the lights on. So we're in luck. We've got half an hour of waiting until it goes dark, and then we'll see it all lit, lit up. They turned all the lights on. Can you see them? They've all been turned on, look, yay. We've just got to wait for it to go a bit darker now. And then we can see everything, hang on. Hang on, I've just had a nice. Yeah, you always say happy holidays, we always say, because it's obviously a, a non-religious word, isn't it, if you say happy holidays. Obviously we're always... Yeah, it's always, we wish you a Merry Christmas, dude. Yeah, you always say happy... Because you, you have to, like, be sort of... You have to sort of be sort of not religious, really, and just say happy holidays, don't we? So it covers everybody, I think. Hang on, let me just... Right, now the, the scope's going to get better now because all the lights have been left on. Look, yay, lights are on. Super, super windy. Yeah, they've turned all the lights on, so let me think where we can go now. Uh, yeah, yeah. so I've just said the word dough under my breath, because I forgot about this, uh, uh, trying to find these 12 days of Christmas things. Obviously, that's just reminding me, seeing them drums drumming. So, let's just remind ourselves by asking about the song, and then we can see what else we can Really, I was hoping to 
get here when it was dark, but obviously it's going to start getting light. We've had the shortest day, so these lights haven't got to play very. Obviously, you can't see the effect because we're not in the pitch dark, but uh, you can't get a ticket for coming in in the dark. You can't get a ticket for coming in in the dark, so it's the best thing to be seen now to come in at night time. Still there. Oh, yeah, it's getting quite windy. Yeah, yeah, it's getting quite windy now. Yeah, it's just because I'm by the open water here, it probably died down when I move away from the water. Just because I'm in the open water. You know, there's one of the fairies lit up. Just see a little bit of colour. Yeah, it's a shame, it's just spoiled it now. I was just going to show you all the things lit up. And uh, it's just not dark enough really to appreciate it at the moment. Let's go down the... Uh, let's go down Let's go down the, uh, let's go, hello, yes, I'm just multitasking at the moment, hang on, I'm just trying to get the 12 days of Christmas on my phone, because I forgot what the days are we're trying to find, they've set, some, yeah, they, 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 they've set something up where you have to try and find the 12 days of Christmas, around the, uh, around where we are, I've just found drummers drumming, now I've got to find the other 11, and we've got half an hour, so I better start that countdown clock. Yeah, look at that. That's cool. Take a screenshot of that, Luke. Yay. Longest rose trellis in England. Longest rose trellis in England. Yeah, longest rose trellis in England, apparently, this is. Right, let me just get me Let me just get Darby's head out of the way. Hang on. Hang on. Let's try and get Darby's head out of the way. Right, right, let's play. Yeah, so you can see all the lights have come on, so you might, I don't know if it'll come across because it isn't really, it isn't really very dark at the moment, so. But luckily they've left all the lights on. So basically people come in about six o'clock when it's really dark and then they walk all around. Everything's been lit up. So uh, there we go. Let's, uh, let's get the 12 days of Christmas on. Do, do, do. Oh, there's a, oh, there's a 12 Days of Christmas, not for kids. I better not play that one. Do, 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 do. Where's the best, best one to click on? Hang on. The trees look very red, the trunks, anyway, yeah. Yeah, I don't think it comes across on camera, but everything's been lit up. The, uh, the rose trellis has been lit up. And the buildings have been lit up over there. Hang on, I've just I've just got the song on YouTube. Hang on, let's try to play the song on YouTube. Hang on, yeah, here we go. Sing along, everybody. Let's try and get back here. Yeah. 
get to the end, she'll be just a repeat of it. to the last one then we're going to repeat them all. Hang on. Yeah, we just repeat them. Let's wait till the last one. Hang on. Hang on. It's going to get annoying if we listen to all that. Hang on. <laughs> Where are we? Hang on. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Oh cool, you're lucky Darby, look they've left all the lights on. Yay, all the lights are on. Yay. Let's enjoy the lights, yeah. Yeah folks, enjoy this, they've left all the lights on for us. You're not supposed to be turned on until 6 o'clock, so. Oh yeah, look. Let's have a look over here. Right. I don't know where these other 11 days are, then I've only seen one, those drums, where are all the others? <laughs> they must be hidden. I forgot, I forgot to get the leaflet, I'll have to get on the way out, I think it's a leaflet, I think. Oh, look at this here. They've lit all the stairs up. So come across on the scope. They've lit all the stairs up. Yeah, yeah look. Yeah, might be a bit darker if we just wait. How long have we got now? Hang on. We've got about 20 minutes, it might get darker. Oh, yeah, we've got some Christmas songs playing. I think we've got some buble in the background. Well, I'm glad the lights are on, that's cheered us up a little bit. It's taken my mind off the cold anyway. Oh yeah, he's a speaker. Got a bit of buble, a bit of buble accompanying us while we're walking. Oh, he's having a blue, blue, blue Christmas. Sounds a bit like Alvis. Blue, blue, blue. Blue, it's going to be blue Christmas without you. I'm going to start singing in a minute. It's going to start raining again. Oh, God. I'm losing my mind. I keep singing. Tell me, stop it, Darby. I feel like singing. Oh. Yeah, anyway, we've got to do... Let me just see what time. Yeah, we've got 15 minutes. Right, let's make the most of the light show. Yeah, they've lit all these, uh, these old buildings up there. Yeah. There you go. Yeah, it says we've got one viewer. Is that Derby? One viewer. Hang on. Buzz, right. Oh, there we go. Yeah, it just ignores you because you come on every day, so I think he just thought, oh, it's Derby again. Just ignore Derby. She's on every day. It's just Derby. Don't count Derby. She's on every day anyway. It's all these cool buildings been lit up. Oh, let's make the most of these. Because basically, I wanted to come at night and you can't go in. I've been so frustrated, and the staff say, Oh, it's only on for three weeks. And you can't come in after six o'clock when it's really dark, you see. So I'll just have to show it you back. Right, there we go. That's a, that's a tribute to when it used to be. Oh, there you go. What's that? That's like a tribute to during the war. This used to be where the Bank of England used to do all the money activities. Uh, that's like a tribute to that. Right, I was just wish I wish I knew this was on, and I might have done my route a bit better. I might have not gone all around the water, but uh, let's just think. There isn't really that much to show you, really. I mean, you pay about. I think you have to pay pay to come in. Really showing you everything. It's just the the rose trellis lit up. Some of the statues are lit up, and obviously some of the old buildings are lit up. That's about it, really. So at least we've been able to have, we've been able to have a little. Uh, We've been able to have, have a little look. Let's go back to where Buble is. I think that's it. I, th I, th I don't know where those 12 days of Christmas are. We might come across another one. 
but I'll come again when they're, if it's a nice day, I'll come, I'll come again and we'll, we'll enjoy it a bit better. You can't enjoy it where you're just dripping wet with water and you're freezing cold. And, but we'll just listen to Michael Bublé, he'll cheer you up. Where's the speaker gone? Oh yes. Yeah, we haven't got to worry about copyright, I think, on Periscope. We can play music on Periscope, I think, on. Yeah, the balustrading, that's what this is called, the balustrading. This is all the old balustrading. You've got, obviously, it's hard to imagine, but just imagine this is a view, Derby. This is, uh, basically, these are the steps up to your house. There used to be a big house on here, like a bit like uh, Downton Abbey. There used to be a big house on here and they knocked it down. And this was obviously, your, this is your view when you used to open your curtains in the morning. This was all your view, this is all your Italian garden, see? This is used to be, if you used to come out your front door, obviously it used to, that's the front door used to be there, see? There. And then these are the stairs. And then that's the view you used to have all the way down there. That's your view. Yeah. There you are, somebody's put all those. I think we can go up that top end. We'll just have a little go up that top end for five minutes. Yeah, we've got time. Yeah. We'll just make our way near the entrance because I think... I just said to him, Mum, get me a hot, hot drink and I put my hands around it. Because I've got my gloves, but it's easy, it's hard, it's just cumbersome trying to, trying to scope with your gloves on. So, uh, yeah, I'll just, I'll just, uh, I'll get the, uh, the warm drink to warm my hands up and I'll look forward to a, a ruby a bit later. But the problem is I commit myself, you know, when you obviously you've got to take all your stuff out with you, I can't just, if it starts raining, I can't really, uh, just say, oh, leave it and stop it, you know. I've, I've gone through a lot of trouble of getting all my stuff charged up and all my stuff ready to go out and scope something. So. Yeah. That's what I need to invest in. That's what I need to, uh, yeah, that's what I need to invest in, like a, uh, that's what I need to invest in, like a, uh, just like a little backpack, you know, just something to pull your bits and bobs in, you know. Just a little one. I've got a, I've got a massive one. I've got a massive one, a big birdhouse one, but it's more for climbing Mount Everest, you know. I've got a massive one, but I just wanted one just to put you, you know, just to put a few bits and bobs in, you know. Or your spare battery and your wallet and your keys. And your, I mean, I've got a little man bag, a little satchel. But I've got a little satchel, but it doesn't fit much in. So then I've got to have my bird food and everything else. Right, that's all. Yeah. Yeah. This might be our little Christmas gift from Tentum Gardens where they've left the lights on all day. So we can all enjoy them if we haven't got a ticket, I suppose. Perhaps that many people perhaps that many people are big. Yeah. I think they're uh, I wonder if that's why the lights are on because the last time they didn't come on until four o'clock. Giving us all a little bit of a, giving us all a bit of a festive cheer. Oh yeah, hey oh yeah, he's a bit of booble. Eh? Oh, Christmas. Oh, hey oh. You can plan. Oh, I'll, I'll sing that booble. It'll start raining again. Oh, the wind's going up. Oh, he's a new fairy. Oh, cool. I think this is a new fairy. Isn't it? Is this a new fairy? Look at this one here. I think I found a new fairy. Oh, hang on. Yeah, that's the company if you want to look them up. Uh, it says Fantasy Wire. That's the company you make them, Fantasy Wire. You can look up their website. There, Fan Fantasy Wire. I think that's a new one they've done. Well, on that big leaf. Yeah, well, they said there's a fairy trail you can go on. There's about 25 of these fairies you have to find. And now I'll have to, I'll have to, get, a, I'll have to get a leaflet from the 12 days of Christmas and then come back when the weather's a bit better and uh, try and hide all those things. We found the drums and that's it. Where's everything else? Uh, I'm just trying to think. Uh, 
where everything else is going to be. I've seen the drums and that's it. But there's another 11 days somewhere, so let's have a look over here. Anyway, I'm glad the lights are on. That's cheered me up a little bit. I'll just ignore my hands going numb as we speak and uh, just think about the hot drink at the end of it. Because I always think, Garb, oh, it's a bit like when you get wet. You can only get so wet, can't you? And then you can't get any wetter. So I feel like my hand can't get my hand can't get any colder. So I've got the uh, you know the numbness has started, so it can't get any more numb. So uh, we'll just ignore it for five minutes. Oh dear. Yeah, I'll have to get some of them gloves where I just cut the fingers off at the end, you know, because it's a lot easier to use your your phone with the ends cut off, isn't it? You know, just. Just cut the fingertips off so you can use your phone easier. But, uh, yeah, do you, see what I, do you see what I mean? That's that church. You know, I started the scope and I show you the churchyard. That's the back of the church, you see. The back of the church is inside Trenton. And then the other side of there, you can, you can see the other side's outside the Trenton fence. That's the, uh, that's the, uh, that's the back end of the church, see. Uh, so that's that. Yeah, we'll make our way out now because I'll put my hand in my pocket just for a second. Hang on. Yeah, we'll go now. I think my me, me hand's saying it's had enough now. So uh, we'll just make our way out. Yeah. I'll have to make do with the inferior hot chocolates that they sell here because the, the cost is about two miles away. So I'll have to have an inferior hot chocolate from here and I'll have a ruby as a to make it up, I'll have to have two drinks and go mad. Go mad and have two drinks. Oh, we are. Oh, we are. Oh, we are. I think this is another uh, day. Well, yeah, what's this one? Hang on. Uh, oh, we are. There's some hats and some shoes. What day of the. What 12 days is that one? We've got hats and shoes. Yeah. Oh, there you are. Yes. Uh, yeah. Yes. Oh, we are. There's a flute. There's a flute. There's a flute. There's shoes and hats. Yeah. Yeah, I've seen a flute, shoes, hot hat. That's all I've seen. Hang on, what's that? See this cool building here, Little. But obviously, it'll look better as you, uh, as we just get a little bit darker. But obviously, we've had the shortest day now. So. Yeah, that, yeah, we've had the pipe. That was the piper's piping. And the. Uh, I'll have to investigate. There's a map. Yeah. Yeah. I'll have to have, add, add day 13 and put uh, 13 rubies drinking. I'll have to have that number 13. 13 rubies drinking. 40. Oh, that's a squirrel. Oh, typical. The squirrel shows his face now we're about to finish. But yeah, I found a, a few nice routes today, so hopefully I'll, uh, if I have some nicer weather, I might return when the weather's a bit better. Oh wait, what's that? That's a weird squeaking. What's going on? Is that your is that your cooking? I can hear squeaking. Uh, yeah, that's what we, we'll have to add some new things to the end of the song. Oh, I think we'll lose. Yeah, it's a bit too. Uh, we are there. This is normally nice in the summer. It usually you see all the leaves have come off it. This is a bit like a like a seat, like a lover's seat inside there. It's usually all covered over with leaves. All the leaves have fell off. Anyway, there's another fairy. Yeah, I haven't seen a, I haven't seen Angel on for a few days. I mean, have you seen her popping up anywhere? I used to have Angel on my scopes. I haven't seen her this week. She's probably busy. Yeah, at least the Australian way. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I think, she, I, I think she's had a few scopes of her own, but I'll say I normally see her in my scope, so uh, we'll see how we go anyway. Yeah. Well, it's a funny... Uh, yeah, it's a funny time of year, though. Probably people have got busy, busy, a lot more busy. I keep watching Periscope. <laughs> but what? Yeah, because I noticed that on... Um, yeah, when, when, I get, when I get my hands defrosted, I'll have to watch a few Haps videos, because... I've seen a few people are doing haps where they do it a bit like um, they do it a bit like Zoom, aren't they? Where there's like four pictures on the screen at the same time. Is that all through a laptop? Where you get four faces on at the same time. That'll be all through a, a laptop, won't it? You get like four callers coming in. Yeah. Yeah.
yeah. Well, I think what'd be what'd be nice is obviously if perhaps you know how you got the call-ins on Periscope. If they had it where you could have like a, a video call in in the corner of your screen, you know, you know, like how you've got your you've got your voice and obviously your picture in the corner. It's a pity that picture couldn't be like a, a video call, you know, where your face, you're, you, I can see you in the corner. Yeah, probably Haps will do that where I can see you in the corner, you know. Yeah. Well, I say we've got three months. Surely it should be even better than Periscope if they keep working on it as much as they are doing. We might say it's better than Periscope. Yeah, I forgot. I for, yeah, yeah, I forgot mentioning about that meeting you had. We'll have to discuss that a bit later when I'm in the warm and I've defrosted myself a bit. Oh. Yeah, because I mean, I'll have to probably. Yeah, I'll have to make a list of what I think could be improved on the. Obviously, I'll have to think. I'll have to have a little sit and have a think about the, uh, about the features. Uh, yeah, if you've got like any information, yeah, I'll have a look through and see if there's anything I've, I've, I can add to the list. Yeah. Right. Right, that's it now, yeah. So I've done my best anyway. I thought I'd come in and make the best of the... While I was having my walk near to Trentham, I thought I may as well come in. I didn't want to just go home anyway, so... Uh, right. Yeah. I'll say this is the... Uh, yeah. Right, let me just uh, let me just finish up my scope for a second. Hang on, where are we? Right, any, any comments we've missed? Uh, I think we're up to date with comments. Hope you've enjoyed this wet and windy live stream in the UK. I've done my best for you in the weather. Uh, nice we've seen some of these uh, these lights, you know, these lights that you should have. Uh, we're very privileged to see them all switched on. Uh, thanks for watching, Derby. Keep, keep me motivated in these cold these cold scopes. I'm uh, No, I think, I think she, she'll tell you. I think she's different. I think it's slightly different than Twitter is, I think. Yeah. Yeah, Tilly, just type, type, in what you, type in what Twitter is. I think it's got a number at the end, I think. I think it's got a number at the end. I think it's Tilly with a number at the end. Yeah, some people's... Some people's yeah, some people's, some people's Twitter is slightly different than the Periscope. I'm, gl I'm glad I... I'm glad I... Uh, yeah, Twitter. That's it, yeah. Melanie Face 61, that's it. I'm just, I'm just, I'm just, I'm just glad I made, I made sure I was Jason Who on everything. It makes it a lot easier for me <laughs> having all these different usernames, and I try to keep everything Jason Who, so I know where I am. But, uh, right, what, uh, what time are we on now? Yeah, yeah, I'll try to talk to you a bit later. I'll try, to, yeah, I'll try to talk to you a bit later on when I'm uh, defrosting my hands a bit. Okay, Darby, stay safe. But make me some cookies and send them over. <laughs> See you on the next one. Right. Okay, Tilly. Uh, I keep forgetting. <laughs> yeah, the cold's getting to me now. I think me, I'm getting brain freeze now from the cold. I think so. I'll just go now, folks. Thanks for watching. Uh, make sure you follow me on all the platforms. I'll update the description to this scope when I finish. To make sure you follow me on YouTube, Twitter. And haps.tv is Jace the Who because I'll be moving over to a different platform soon. And uh, I'm on buymeacoffee.com as well if you want to support these uh, these uh, scopers in the UK trying to keep scoping in the winter and the cold and the rain. It's much appreciated. And uh, I think that's everything. I'll uh, I'll just finish the scope there now. I'll give you a little preview of the lights. And uh, I'll go try and get warmed up. And I'll try to do daily scopes. If you're new to me, just check out my replays. I've got over 300 uh, scopes done. And I do nature, wildlife, heritage, uh, bird feeding, canal walks. Lots of different things. Try and keep a variety to it. But uh, it's weather dependent because obviously we're getting a lot of uh, a lot of rain and wind at the moment. So uh, obviously if it's, if it's dry when I come out, I'll try and do a scope every day. Because I've, uh, I've got plenty of data at the moment. So... Uh, We'll just hope, just keep your fingers crossed we have some sunny days and then it makes scoping a bit easier.
Okay, folks. Thanks for watching. Thanks, Tilly. Thanks, Darby. I'll see you on the next one. Stay safe, everyone. Have a happy holidays. Merry Christmas if I don't see you before. And uh, I'll uh, see you on the next one. Bye for now.